Love is God and God is love. A relationship without God is as good as using it because God is the foundation of love. Hello friends, my name is John Nathan Owara and I welcome you to this next episode of Embrace. It's good to have you here. We're talking parenting. It's been a wonderful season talking about parenting. Let's pray. Our Lord and our God, as we continue speaking and talking about parenting, guide us through because you are our parent. Parenting starts in you and ends in you. Starts with you and ends with you. Thank you in Jesus name. Amen. It's a wonderful time to have you guys here. Today we talk the role of a parent, the role of a parent. And we'll focus on two. We we'll talk focus on a father and focus on a mother. So let's talk about a father. What's the role of a father in parenting? When you are training a child in the way they should go, as a father what is your role first we need to understand that a father is a source jesus taught us to pray saying our father who art in heaven in matthew chapter 6 verse 9 what he meant was our father where everything stems from the source of everything our father our source so a father is a source. It's important that you as a father know that you are the source. You are the source of everything. Everything that happens in your house, you are the source. In your family, you are the source, good or bad. Just like God is our source of everything, you as a father, you're the source of everything in that family. Heaven is a place of abundance. It's our home, a place of plenty and there's no lack. The Bible tells us homes should be places of provision. Where a father stays, there should be, a, should be a place of plenty. Where a father is, there should be plenty. So what is your role as a father? You are a source. But let's break it down. A father as a head. A father is the head of the family. A father is the head of the family. A head has eyes. And shall look at each of the roles of this of some of the things that are the parts of the head the father has a head of the family the heads the head has eyes the eyes are supposed to see where the family is going you are the vision bearer as a father you are the vision bearer the eyes have eyelashes the eyelashes protect the eyes from dust and from other things so it's supposed to protect the vision of the family as a father, you have vision, you know where the family is going, and you're supposed to protect the vision of the family at whatever cost. So if you don't have a vision, this Bible tells us that my people perish. Where there's no vision, people don't know where to go. It's important that you have vision. The head has a nose. As a father, you're supposed to smell danger and protect. You're supposed to smell danger. The nose is for smelling. You smell danger. When something is rotten, you're supposed to know before it comes out. You're supposed to sort it out as a father. A father has ears. The head has ears. The father is supposed to listen. The head has two ears and one mouth. You listen more than you talk. A father's role is to listen. Listen. If the head has a brain, it's the role of the father to think for the family. You think and you interpret. Think where we are going. Think about what we are going to eat. Think, 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 think. You don't say, I also don't know. When, you, when the mother asks you, what, what are you going to eat? I also don't know. You are supposed to think. You are the head of the family. Think, use your brain, think. The head has a mouth. A father is supposed to use his tongue. Test good or bad. Because the mouth has a tongue. The mouth has teeth. The teeth are for tearing and chewing. You need to chew through some things before they come out. The mouth is for speaking. Speak good about your family. A father is supposed to speak good about his family. 
Wherever you go, speak good because you carry your family. You're an ambassador. Speak good about your family. Don't speak negative about your family. The head has hair. The hair covers the head. It's for protection from sun rays. Also for beauty. The father is a source of beauty in a home. <laughs> the father is a source of protection. The father protects the family from all that should come. Any negative forces. That's the role of a father. Today, look at the father as the head of the family. I pray that this teaches you something. A mother only helps the father in those roles. A father is the head of the family. For this segment of episode, this episode of Embrace, we stop here for today. I hope you've learned something.